The purpose of this demonstration is to show you how you can uh, have ratings per individual contacts in Odoo and calculate those ratings. So the first place we're going to want to go is if we look at the contact record of any customer or vendor or whatever you want to define it as down here, we'll see that there can be ratings associated. In addition to that, we can see average rating is calculated here automatically. If we click here, we'll see all the ratings that have uh, that are related to this contact and you can open it up and see here just a very brief summary of the contact what the rating is this time around we can say four uh, you know the date if you want to change this you can use Odoo Studio to quickly you know make a change like that from new to just uh, from to just date updates the interface and then you can have your notes here quickly you know type in everything went well save it down here of course you can associate it to a leader opportunity on a in a CRM and of course a salesperson can uh, be added as well if you want these to automatically uh, update that's something we can do as well you can send messages out here if you want to uh, link John Doe to this you can communicate or you can log internal notes with colleagues right below this uh, this rating record as well so um, pretty straightforward It'll take all those ratings and sum them. As you see, it's 66 now. If we go in here and create a new rating for something astronomical, um, the date, you know, high save, we'll calculate and bump our rating up. So that's one way that ratings can be calculated. Another way is if you go into the CRM and if we look at our customer, uh, we have our pipeline here, but we can also next to customer see something called rating. It gives us an overview of any ratings that have been created. Um, of course, you know, we can group by contact, you can filter out specific contacts, um, things like that out of the box and create new ratings fresh. But I assume, you know, if you want to look at it through the lens of like a, uh, a CRM pipeline, you know, we can create a new one here and say uh, John Doe, link the customer, create edit, just like that, we can see ratings up here as well. So if I click ratings, you can create a new one and associate it automatically to this lead opportunity. Give it a 50, save. Um, and you can, of course, if you wanna have the contact, in this instance, I tried to make the contact automatically update based on the uh, contact specified on the lead opportunity. That is something that we can do as well. Go into studio. Here, actually, we want to take this option. Go like this. Go like this. More. Edit. Depend. It'll be a related field, so we'll have um, first the that, then the partner ID, the name of the field on the record. And then if I go back and test, create a new rating, create for John, and it will automatically populate John Doe as we see up there, given the rating to find how the went, just like that. And if we give a, another number, I think it was 200 something last time, 100,000 something crazy, um, then we can go to customer, John Doe, and we'll see that rating automatically updated to that average computed. So that's just one example, and of course, all those ratings are going to be calculated or kept here, including the most recent one. So that's one example of how ratings can be uh, can work in Odoo, and how you'll be able to use them as part of your uh, you know customer management process. If you have any additional questions or any other information that you want to discuss with me, I'll be happy to uh, to go through that with you. Thanks.